Hello, hello, it's Julie Davison from juliedavison.com. So glad that you could join me live here on Facebook. And if you're watching the replay, go ahead and still say hello when you pop on. Let me know that you are watching. I'm so excited about all the new products in the Occasions catalog. And so I just wanted to take a few minutes today to show you all of the new paper, all of the new embellishment, all of the new ribbon and, um, and buttons and trinkets, all these fantastic things. In fact, I know you're going to love them so much that I put together a little product share so that you could try all of the new products without having to spend a ton of money. So um, with my product share, you get a little bit of everything. You get a few of each of the embellishments. You get a yard of each ribbon. I promise it won't come in a big ball <laughs> like this. You get a yard of each ribbon. You get six by six pieces of all the new designer paper. So you get a chance to really try out all the stuff and decide what you like and what you want more of. So today I'm going to show you all of those products, get you a little closer look at what they look like up close and personal and also share some project ideas with you. So as a demonstrator I participate in card swaps where I make a bunch of the same card and then I trade them with other demonstrators who've made a bunch of their same card so that I get a bunch of different cards. So I have got some really great project ideas to share with you um, from my card swap basket and I will identify the um, stamping artist as best I can if they've marked their card. Um, so today I'm going to show you all of those projects. I have 38 different swap cards to show you today and um, we're just going to step through the catalog so I'm going to start at the beginning and then um, work towards the end. As you know we've got celebration going on right now so when you spend $50 or more you can choose a free gift from the celebration brochure so that is super exciting my favorite time of the year. So if you decide to sign up for my product share it's $35.85 plus postage and then you can choose a celebration gift if you add on $20 in product because the, the product share product amount is like $29.95 um, and then the $35 includes tax and shipping. So if you add $20 in product, you can choose a free celebration gift with your product share. Um, and so I'll show you that in a little bit. But we're going to start with the Occasions catalog. And so I'm going to skip all the bundles and all the stamp sets. And today what I'm focusing on is just showing you the actual product and what comes in my Occasions catalog product share. So the first thing we have is the All My Love. And the All My Love designer paper is kind of a Valentine themed paper. Except because our paper is double sided. Even the sides that have hearts on it still have other patterns on the other side. So even the Valentine paper is going to be great for all spring, all year round. Like you can just really make some gorgeous cards using these papers. I envision like Mother's Day and Easter. So really gorgeous papers. This is the All My Love paper. And as I said, all of these papers you'll be um, getting in the product share. So the product share includes six by six pieces. This suite has coordinating ribbon for the paper. It has the lovely lipstick and the flirty flamingo these come in a combo pack so you get um, a roll of each ribbon in the combo pack with my product share you'll get a yard of each ribbon and then the embellishments that go with this one are the epoxy hearts so you'll get a strip of those to try those out so let me share some project ideas using the all is love Oh, I'm sorry, All My Love Sweet and Designer Paper. We have this project here that Mary Ellen Stites, um, she designed this card for our team meeting last month, so we got to make this as a make and take. So it's got a little bit of the paper here and showing off the gorgeous Forever Lovely bundle. Then this card here is a swap card from um, my mom, Susan LaCroix. She used the rectangle stitch frame, it's the new lace embossing folder, and really that piece of designer paper is the highlight of this um, card here for Valentine's Day, so gorgeous. And then this one here uses the same paper, and this was a make and take at the onstage event that I went to uh, in November. So um, they had this project for us. It's got the ribbon incorporated here too. This is another swap card. I'm not sure who this one is from. Oh no, I remember making this. We made this at a team meeting over in Springfield. Maybe, oh my gosh, I forgot to write down who designed it. Was it Rayanne? I'm just drawing a blank. I'm thinking, oh my goodness. Oh, I don't know. 
it was either Allison or Carla. I'm so sorry. And if it's not either one of those, I'm so sorry to the person who did it. But I love it. It's got the paper. And then we use the blends to color on the enamel heart there. And so we've got this ribbon from the combo pack. So gorgeous, gorgeous card there showing the stitched border as well. This one uses some of the heart framelits that's on the next page. But we've got a little bit of that designer paper in there, stitched rectangle framelits. And here's another one of the enamel hearts colored with the blends. So the enamel hearts are clear and you can color those with the Stampin' Blends, which are an alcohol marker to um, decorate your card. Now, the this paper, like I said, it's not just for Valentine's Day. So here's a sample using the new Tea Together stamp set. And we've got the teapot there. Again, this gorgeous lace embossing folder. I don't have this one yet and I need to get it. It is amazing here this one is a hostess stamp set i am what i am because of you i love it and it doesn't look valentiney we've got the colors but it's still just really gorgeous this is one oh i forgot to say the stamping artist this one's from betsy Kreider, and the tea together um, card was by mary mcneely and then um, this heart is by april lopez then we've got um this one doesn't have a name maybe it's on the inside let me see if I can open it up. Mary Polson made this card using the Hello Cupcake stamp set, and you've got a peek of the All My Love paper in there. So again, it's not just for Valentine's Day. You can really use that for um, any, any time of the year. Okay, so there's all our cards, and again, here's the All My Love paper, and the ribbon, and the um, epoxy heart. So all of those products come in my product share, and we're gonna skip along to the next suite so I can show you some more awesome new products. We have the Floral Romance Suite. This one is really cool because it's a specialty designer paper. It has um, two patterns that are just regular solid sheets, and so you've got these gorgeous patterns in mossy meadow and soft sea foam. This is a wood green pattern. And then we've got the petal pink with the flex. And then the other two sheets in this pattern paper pack are designer vellum. And they are just really cool. I think, let me flip this over here so you can see. Um, just how awesome that is. It really pops once you put the um, cardstock behind it. So we've got this one and then look at that gorgeous petal pink lace. So this one, because it's the specialty vellum, uh, you'll only get four sheets because there are only four patterns in this paper pack. And then the embellishments that go with this one, we've got these awesome floral romance seals. These are like the hot wax seals. Did you ever um, have you ever done that where you melt wax and then you use like a stamp to um, create that seal? So this is sort of the look of that and it's just on an adhesive circle. So you'll get three of those and then also the frosted floral um, flowers. These are so pretty. A little bit of dimension on there and they come in the three colors, the fresh fig, clear and petal pink. And the coordinating ribbon in this suite is the petal pink and whisper white variegated ribbon. Um, look how gorgeous this is. And it's kind of like a seam binding. So it's really soft, really easy to, um, to tie. So in my product share, you'll get a yard of the ribbon, you'll get the six by six papers, and you'll get the embellishments. And so here are some samples from my card swap stash. Um, this first one is by Tammy Ackerson. She used a little bit of the designer vellum and, and um, backed it with some petal pink. So you see the pink showing through. And then she's using the, um, the frosted embellishment flower. And then this card is not labeled. Maybe it's on the inside. Let me see here. This is by Colleen Magnus. And she's got kind of like a little half fold there. It's uh, cut off on the front. So she's using a piece of the vellum and also the paper. This die comes in the bundle here, the wonderful romance set, and then the variegated ribbon. So, so pretty in this card. And this last card also doesn't have a name. Let me see if I can look on the inside. This card is by Susan Elise Morton, and she's showing off this gorgeous border die. This, again, is in the wonderful floral romance framelits. Um, and then she's got the designer paper in there too. So gorgeous cards um, using that wonderful romance. This is just so pretty and springy, tropical. I could see um, these items being so great for weddings, but also if you were doing a scrapbook of a tropical vacation, it'd be so pretty, or even doing some vintage 
vintage scrapbooking with photos that would be so pretty. So this is the Floral Romance, and again, all of these items are included in my product share, so if you sign up for that, you'll get a chance to play with all these things without having to buy the full packages in the catalog. The next suite is How Sweet It Is, and this has the really fun candy, cupcakes, sweets. I love the bright colors in this paper. We've got Highland Heather, Gorgeous Grape, Granny Apple Green, Melon Mambo, we've got the Daffodil Delight, Coastal Cabana, and of course all these papers are double-sided, so you get the fun candy prints on the other side as well. And um, the fun thing about this one is that the framelits coordinate with the designer paper and the stamp set. So for example, on this designer paper, you can use the jar of sweet framelits to die cut the images from the designer paper. So that is really fun. It die cuts the the stamp shapes but also the designer paper okay so the product share includes six by six pieces of all of this check out this coordinating ribbon this is like the coolest ribbon I've ever seen it's reversible one side is blue coastal cabana and the other side is granny apple green isn't that fun so you'll get a yard of this in the product share and then I could not figure out a way to mail the sweet cups but they are a really fun little size to make treats with and then the product share does include one each of the tags I'm trying to see if you can see the um, the kind of like shimmer coating as a border on these tags so you have like really fun shapes and then it has that little accent. So if you were to watercolor over them, it would resist that and, and still show you the cool border. So these little tags come with clips and you can put them on the tags to use them. So you'll get three tags um, inside your product share, all those products. And I have just a couple samples to share with you um, using, using these um, products from this suite. This is by Amy Story. She created this card using those stitched rectangle framelits. I love how she has that sweet little bow. And she incorporated the um, glittered enamel dots. These are in the annual catalog, but the colors perfectly coordinate with this suite. I love how the um, product designers were really thinking about product coordination and how we can use those things together. So all the colors in the glittered enamel dots are the same colors that are in the paper. So you're definitely gonna wanna get those too. And then this card was by Rachel Chamberlain and she again used a different jar image to stamp and die cut. And then we've got the sweet little strip of designer paper back there. So this is the How Sweet It Is sweet and it is just so sweet. So that's also included in the product share. Our next suite here, let me see if I can flip to it. Our next product suite is the Happiness Blooms. And this is really fun too, lots of bright colors. A little bit darker, more primary colors we're featuring the um, Call Me Clover, Night of Navy, Lovely Lipstick, Pineapple. Uh, and then what do we have? Grapefruit Grove too, yeah, and Calypso Coral. Um, so these are some of the new colors, the new in colors, and these are just so like vibrant and, um, and bright. I love these patterns. And um, this paper comes in 12 by 12, so I've just cut it down to six by six for the product share, and you'll get one of each pattern, which was double-sided. So more great patterns that are really versatile. Now this stamp set that comes in the, um, in the suite is called Bloom by Bloom, and it is available in a bundle with a punch pack. So let me do a little close up on the punch pack because I didn't bring it out with me. It punches out little bitty flowers. Bitty Blooms is the punch pack. And so it actually will punch out the flowers that are in the paper. So again, they're coordinating with the designer paper so that you can punch the, um, the images right out. So like this one would punch out, these little ones would punch out, um, where was it? Oh, this one, all the little daisy flowers, those would all punch out. So they coordinate with the punch pack. So let me show you some cards. I actually have quite a few um, swap cards using this paper. Oh, let me show you first the other products. So we have this Calypso Coral Satin Ribbon. I love this width of ribbon. It's 3 8 inch, and I think it works really well in a lot of different cards. This is a really soft satin ribbon, but it still has some um, weight to it, so it's not, um, it's not, you know, really flimsy. It's a really pretty ribbon. And then the coordinating product is the enamel dot. So these are in the coordinating colors, the pineapple punch, night of navy, lovely lipstick, 
Calypso Coral and um, Colony Clover is the green. So let me show you some of these samples. This first card was created at OnStage. This was one of the make and takes that I got to make that Stampin' Up! designed. They actually used a larger Knight of Navy note card that comes with the Memories and More note card pack and I cut it down um, so that it would fit with my other card samples. So this uses some of the designer paper back here and um, and then I think some of this too is cards from the Memories and More pack, but they all coordinate. So we've got that, some enamel dots in here. And then this swap card is by Missy Shipman, and she used the Biddy Blooms punch. And you can really see the punches very well in her card sample. Um, she did them in cardstock to um, sort of highlight the sentiment. And then of course we've got the designer paper in the background, such a bright and beautiful card. This next card was created by Mary Ellen Stites. She really showed off the paper beautifully with little one inch strips of six different patterns from the Happiness Blooms paper. And then we've got the sentiment in a tailored tag punch, which I um, just love, one of my favorites. And the Calypso Coral ribbon really ties it together. Haha, <laughs> pun intended. Here's another sample. This one was by Mary McCormick, and she actually copied or cased right from the catalog. So you can see her inspiration right here. She used a little um, little bit of a different punch instead of the label die cut. And then she also um, incorporated the, the navy twine a little bit differently. But I love that she just copied right from the catalog. You really can get a lot of inspiration right from our catalogs by um, copying the designs you see there. So the red flowers are punch outs that she added with glue dots and then added the rhinestones. Here's another card. This one is one that I created. I incorporated some of the designer paper and the ribbon and also some of the enamel dots. I featured this card on my blog this morning if you saw it and talked about the well written um, bundle. This is a really fun bundle. It includes uh, stamp set with 51 different word images and then the framelit set has 24 dies which include a lot of scripty word or yeah words so you can combine them to make um, that that combination of um, script and print so I, I just love that style so the well written I think is going to be a really popular bundle this catalog this card here um, was designed by Meg Lovin. She actually just gave it to me last night. And as I'm looking at the catalog, I can see where she got her inspiration right here from the catalog with the big piece of designer paper in the background and then the stitch circle with the stamped um, stamped image. And then we've got a strip of the designer paper. So Meg was inspired by the catalog, but as you can see, just used different designs from the paper pack. So this is another really great way to um, copy from the catalog is to adapt the ideas that you see for the supplies that you have. So another great card. This last one is um, no Noelish. I'm not sure. Uh, I just have a last name on this card, so I'm not sure the first name of the card or the person who made this card, but I love the combination of the paper with the different layers and the banner and the oval. And um, she also included some of the ribbon and the, um, the enamel dots there as well. So lots of samples featuring the Happiness Blooms um, suite. And again, all of these products, the six by six paper and the ribbon and the embellishments are all included in my product share. So these are all things you guys are seeing, all the different things that you can do with the product share. You get a little bit of everything um, to make up the cards and things that you want. It's a really great way to, to try everything before, try before you buy. Our next suite is the Gingham Gala Suite. This is, I think, gonna be a very popular suite. I know I've already used it a whole bunch. I love the butterflies, but look at this gorgeous gingham paper. It is just so fun and bright and springy. The colors are Daffodil Delight, Highland Heather, Calypso Coral, nope, Grapefruit Grove, sorry, Grapefruit Grove, Lemon Lime Twist, and Balmy Blue. And again, this paper is double-sided, so we've got the small gingham on this side and then the larger gingham on the other side, same color, so blues on blue. And this is a six by six paper pack, so you get 40 sheets um, and you get eight of each color, so eight yellow, eight purple, eight um, Calypso Coral and so on. So in the product share you'll get one of each to try. The coordinating ribbon in this suite is this Whisper White Flax ribbon which just really ties in and goes with all of the um, all of the different papers and then we've got the Gingham Gala uh, adhesive sequins. So you will get 10 of each color for a total of 50 
um, sequins in this package. And while we're on this one, I just want to show you really quick. From the Celebration brochure, you can choose as a free gift when you order $50 or more, you can choose this ribbon pack, this organdy ribbon pack, and the colors are exactly the same as the colors in the gingham paper. Look at that. Like Stampin' Up! was really planning ahead. So if you get the... Um, if you get the gingham paper, you can choose that um, for free when you order, have a qualifying order during celebration. Okay, so gorgeous ribbon that matches. And I want to show you, I do have some samples using the butterflies. These are two cards that I've made using this gingham gala or butterfly gala stamps that I incorporated that celebration ribbon here, the balmy blue, and um, have the butterflies punched out. So, so gorgeous. I love, love, love how it just pops. But I wanted to show you, you don't have to only use this gingham paper for the butterflies. So I have a ton of swap cards to show you. Um, I only picked out a handful here. So I'm going to show you how they use the gingham paper in other ways with other stamp sets. So this first card doesn't have a name on it. Let me see if I can find it inside the card. Oh, yes. Julie Salva made this card using the new, um, I don't know the name of it, the dog bundle that has the punch. How so cute is this? I wouldn't have thought about using the gingham paper with the um, the dog stamp set, but it's perfect. I think it goes so well. So we've got that. This next card also doesn't have a name. Let me peek inside. And this one is by Karen Titus. So Karen used the, um, the piece by piece, I think it's called, is the cake um, bundle. And, in, and then it has a coordinating punch. So you stamp the cake in the stand and then you can punch them out. So she incorporated the sequin as well. And I just think it's so cute. It says, may your love grow sweeter with every passing year. So this would be perfect for an anniversary card. And again, she incorporated the gingham paper. So it's not, not, not just for the butterflies. This next card also probably has a name tucked inside. I should have looked at all these. Mary Polson created this card with the um, the fairy tale friends stamp set. So this is sort of like a Peter Rabbit kind of image. Such a cute, cute card. And she incorporated the Grapefruit Grove gingham back there. So so many different looks, all from the same paper. This one is by Faith Steinberg, and she incorporated the new Butterfly Thin Lip. Check out how gorgeous and amazing this large thin lip is. It has actually two layers. There's two dies. So this would be the bottom layer, and then there's another one that's the same size that has more of a detailed cut to it, and you can layer that on top of this for an even more, like, two-dimensional, really, I guess that would be more like three-dimensional with the, um, really the depth of the layers there, so... Amazing card by Faith using the Balmy Blue. Uh, this is a card I designed for a card swap that I participated in using the So Happy Together um, stamp set from the Celebration brochure. So this is one that you can get for free um, in the Celebration catalog. And I thought that the Lemon Lime Twist Gingham paper was just so perfect. And you know what? I wasn't the only one because I have another swap card. Let me see if I can find the name really quick open that up. Julie Salva created this card using the gingham paper and the frog as well. So um, she used the larger of the gingham and I used the smaller one so you can see how those looks. And this blue is the balmy blue. It coordinates with that paper pack. So, And the paint, and this is that ribbon that goes with it too. Um, Christine is asking where is the gingham paper? Let me move my stuff out of the way. This is the occasions catalog. It's on page 35. It's on the same page as the butterflies, but it's right here. It's a six by six paper pack, it includes 40 sheets. So you get eight sheets of each color. And I've got one more swap card to show you featuring the gingham paper. This one is by um, Jose Smuck, and she used the Grapefruit Grove, but still combined it with the same color combination with the balmy blue. And then the cupcake is in the celebration book. It's the Hello Cupcake stamp set right here. You can get that for free with a $50 order. And there again is the ribbon that coordinates with the gingham gala paper. And actually, let me point this out because I really love this. I don't know if you guys... Um, have seen this but we have these like you can make it uh sort of bundles so this one is um called incredible like you and they have one item number for everything to make these cards okay so you can get the incredible like you stamp set the gingham gala paper 
thick cardstock, and then three stamp pads, and then the adhesive back sequins. And when you purchase all of these, and you can do it with one item number, it's $65.75, then you can choose the ribbon as your free product to use on these cards. So I love how they have these sort of call outs in the catalogs where you can shop by project. So in my online store at juliedavison.com slash shop, in the sidebar, you'll see actually under celebration, celebration project ideas and so you can click on that and it will show you these projects and it will list all of the items that you need and you can just like check mark the boxes of the products that you want and you can either order all of them or you can order just the ones that you want to make these cards and then qualify for your free ribbon so um, more of the gingham gingham gala is so gorgeous so all these cards look at that one two three four five, six, seven, eight, nine different cards with so many different stamp sets, eight different stamp sets using the same paper pack. So it's not just for butterflies. Gorgeous. This will come in the product share, the six by six, one of each, a little bit of the sequins, one yard of the ribbon, and then not the cards, sorry, you don't, you don't get the cards in the product share, but you can make all of these cards with your product share order. Our next suite is the Needlepoint Nook. Do you have the Biddy, um, Biddy Punch Pack? Okay, let me go back and show you that card. I don't have the Biddy Punch Pack in this room with me. It is across the way in the other room. But I'm going to show you this um, sample card again, Andrew. This uses the punch pack, so you can see there's three different flower shapes, and then the fourth punch punches the center and the leaf at the same time. So these are the really small punches, right? They're just like, you know, that that big. They're small bitty punches. The punch pack is a, it's a four pack, and so these are the flowers that it, it punches. Okay, moving on to the Needlepoint Nook. This is really just um, so fun. My favorite thing in this whole suite is the stitched die in this set, Needlepoint Elements Framelit Dies. This die, look at what it does. Isn't that amazing? Like, I, oops, it's upside down. <laughs> I want this whole set just for this, um, just for this stitched flower that it creates with the dies. I think it's so cool. So let me back it up. I'm not showing you the, the stamps and the dies today. I'm just going to show you the paper, the Needlepoint Nook designer paper. And this looks like a photograph because it kind of is. Like someone actually stitched these designs and then photographed them and created the designer paper. So I just think that is so neat, the way it looks like it's really stitched because it was. Um, so this is, this is really cool. We've got all these um, designs that look stitched. And then the back side has more of like um, just a regular pattern paper. So the stitch is all on one side. And then the back side we have just like patterns. Okay, so we've got Old Olive, um, Poppy Parade, and the uh, Berry Burst, Highland Heather, Flirty Flamingo, and Night of Navy. So if you're wanting to create some cool patterns without having the, the photographic look, you can do that as well. This, so this is needle, po needle Point Nook. And then the ribbon in here is the Old Olive Linen Thread. It comes on a big spool like this. For the product here, you'll get one and a half yards, a little bit more. Um, so you'll have some, some fun with that. And then you'll get six of these little, um, little mini buttons. So they're really light in color. There's actually three different colors. There's a like a, a petal pink, Sahara sand, and very vanilla. So just a really tiny, tiny little button. So cute. And those you'll get six of those in the product share. And you can see, oh, I don't have a button. I thought I did on this card. You could totally put a button on this card. This would be cute. This was one that we made it on stage. This was one of the make and takes. And so we incorporated the designer paper in the background and then that gorgeous stitched um, stitch die and then we've got the the old olive linen thread there and then the second card is um, a swap card from Linda Bowen and she used the designer paper and just folded it down she combined it with the butterfly gala stamp set so you've got the butterflies in different colors and just a really really pretty card so I haven't had a chance to play a whole lot that's why I don't have more samples 
um, with this bundle yet, but it's so pretty. And you'll get all of those, not the whole spool, just a yard and a half with your product share. So you can create all kinds of needlepoint cards and projects. The next suite is the classic garage. I just realized I forgot a project on my desk. But um, look at these amazing cards. I just love the cards that they've created here. I'm really inspired to, um, to copy those in case, especially this one. I really like the layout and how they use designer paper to look like washi tape. Um, this is really cool. So I've got the designer paper. Now this is a six by six paper pack. So it comes with 12 each of, uh, or four each of 12 different designs. So in your product share, you're gonna get one each of all those papers. Okay, so there's 12 different papers papers and they're all the same colors. We've got the bright crushed curry and then what's the green in here? Let's see. Tranquil Tide, Real Red Paper Pumpkin, Paper Pumpkin, Pumpkin Pie. <laughs> oh my goodness. And you can just see the really fun um, garage car travel theme. Look at that map. Um, paper. So these are going to be so great for masculine cards. Now, I just saw this tip yesterday. I think it's really fun. There is a gear die in, um, in this bundle and it fits on the designer paper. So again, I love that you can use our dies and punches to cut out the images right from the paper. So um, what else is in here? Oh, I bet the gas can um, will cut out that as well in the circle punches. Maybe not the gas can. Let's take a look at the other sides. I'm going to flip them all over this gas can. I bet the die cuts out that gas can. Okay, flipping it over, we have some more neutral patterns on the other side. So if you're looking for a good masculine paper, even if you're not into the garage kind of a theme, look at that. I love the sort of just um, distressed images that we have back here. Here's like a, a motor, really subtle in the background there. And um, just really great patterns for any kind of guy card. Um, with the wheels, we've got the the little nuts. This one looks like it has tire tracks on it. Motorcycles, that's a fun one. And then the yellow, the crushed curry. Okay, so that's the classic garage paper. The uh, the coordinating embellishments and stuff are really cool. Check out this ribbon. It is a black ribbon with a solid, um, like shiny silver in the middle. And it's, a, it's really kind of a soft ribbon. It's gonna be really easy to tie around your projects. And then the elements here are these little metal elements. So there's a key and a wrench. In the product share, you'll get one of each and you can use those on your projects. Now I imagine if you put those on your card, it's gonna be extra postage. So just be aware of that. So here's a card designed by my upline, Kim Peck, and she used um, the, the key up here on that. So, um, that is going to take extra postage if you're mailing that. You're a classic. I love this car. And in this moment right now, I just realized I have a son who's 15 and a half. And <laughs> when he turns 16 in September, I could make him a card with a little key on it in this car because he's going to be able to start driving. <laughs> oh, I'm so sad. But I'm happy that we have these awesome products that I'll be able to make him a really cool birthday card, even though I'll be crying he'll be driving <laughs> this card I think it's by BJ Peters let me double check it on the inside um, no it's by Georgia she designed this card but BJ did a great presentation on stage which is why I thought that it might be her card um, she did some awesome things with the um, with this paper, the, the classic garage paper. So this is a great way to show off designer paper in any pattern. So whether it's this one or a different package, this is a really great layout for a card. And um, I just love how it incorporates all of those papers. So again, I haven't had a chance to play too much with the classic garage, so I only have those two cards to show you, but you can do all kinds of fun things. And again, all those pieces will come in the product share the six by six paper and the ribbon, one yard and the elements. Okay, so those are all the suites in the catalog, but as a little bonus, when you sign up for my product share, I am including um, six by six pieces of the designer paper in the celebration catalog. It's called Botanical Butterfly. And um, you'll get these also in your product share, even though they're not in the occasions catalog. It's just kind of my bonus to you. Um, it is a 12 by 12 paper, so I'm cutting it down for the product share. You'll get a six by six piece of each pattern. And as you can imagine by the name Botanical Butterfly, there are butterflies in the paper. That is sort of the theme. So 
Um, look at how gorgeous these are colored. They're just ready to be cut out and added to a card. Um, so a lot of these papers, I will show you this side first. We've got, I just love this pattern. It might be my favorite. Like it's just really subtle, but so pretty, soft purple. This one, and well, both of these here, will punch out using the new butterfly duet punch. So there's a, a small butterfly and a big butterfly on the punch, and these will, these will coordinate and punch out perfectly. So you can punch them all out using your punch instead of hand cutting them. And the back side of all these papers are black and white designs. So just so classic and gorgeous. So again, these butterflies will punch out with the punch so you can color those yourself. And then we've got the black and white gingham, black and white butterflies. This is like a color book style. We saw some really cool demonstrations on stage where they just color the butterflies or around the butterflies just to make them pop. So I'm excited to play with this pattern. I have some cards to show you using that bonus of the botanical butterfly um, paper. This first one, I've got to open it up and show you because it's really kind of cool. This one was designed by my mother, Susan LaCroix, and it's got um, sort of a short front there. So it, it opens up and you, it covers up the inside, so I kind of like how that was. She also incorporated the butterfly elements, and this is another celebration gift choice. You can choose this for free with a $50 order during celebration, um, and it coordinates really nicely. Now this shape here is the same size as the butterfly punch, so you could layer those as well. So I, I love how Stampin' Up! just thinks about all of those things. Um, this card is by Joyce Farako. I love how she used the black and white and just really made a classic black and white card. It's just so gorgeous. This card is one that we did as a make and take at our open house last night. It was um, designed by Meg Loven and she used the designer paper and then stamped the butterfly from the stamp set and punched it out. But you can see how the design is just the same as what's on the paper. This next card was created by Natalie Travis. And again, she's got the front cut short there. A Little bit of designer paper. And then this butterfly is punched out from the paper. So she used the paper on both of those. And the last card here was um, created by Diana Gibbs. And she used a little bit of the designer paper and then um, I think that looks like, yeah, it's just punched out right from the paper, I would guess. There it is. So expertly colored. Diana is an amazing colorer, so that's why I wasn't sure if she had colored it or if it was designer paper, but it is. Now, this stamp, know that today a friend is thinking of you, and this one, I'm so glad you are part of my story, and this one, here's to those who inspire us and don't even know it. All of those sentiments come from a stamp set in the celebration catalog. It's called Part of Your Story, Part of My Story. And um, this is a really fun one. When Stampin' Up! was creating this stamp set, they asked demonstrators to submit ideas for sentiments, for greetings. And so all of the sentiments that are included in this stamp set um, are suggestions that were given by demonstrators. So I thought that was such a really cool way to have demonstrator input on product. So this is another free choice during celebration. You can choose the stamp set for free with a $50 order. And so here are some samples using that stamp set. All right, well, I showed you 38 different project ideas today. I hope that you are inspired by all of the card swaps and, and um, samples that I had to share with you. If you would like to sign up for a product share, as I said, you'll get a six by six piece of all the papers from the catalog, and you'll get a yard each of the ribbon and some of all of the embellishments so that you can make your own projects, whether they be like these or other ones. Um, I know that you'll be inspired to use all your new goodies. So if you're interested in signing up for a product share, just go ahead and um, you can make a note on this video. Just post below a comment that says, hey, I'm interested in the product share. You can also send me an email or private message me. The cost is $35.85. And then then um, there's an additional cost for postage for me to send it to you. So I'm going to order all the supplies and then I'll cut everything apart and package it up really pretty um, and send it to you. So you'll get those in about a week or two after I order the supplies. So if you're interested, just pop me a note, let me know. And then as I said, since it's celebration, you can choose to add on a 
$100 product order um, to qualify for a celebration gift. So if that's something that you're interested to get some of those extra free things like the stamp sets I told you about or the extra ribbon pack or the extra butterfly elements, that is an option. So uh, let me know if you're interested in the product share. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day and I'll catch up with you later. Bye.